Remember the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy episode? Who killed who? In the episode, Mandy retrieves some dice from a house. There is a scene where she meets a woman named Miss Doolin, voiced by Betty White. She is, of course, an elderly woman who converses with Mandy over what Billy had said to Mandy. At the end of the episode, we discover that Miss Doolin actually beat the Grim Reaper in a staring contest. After she and Mandy scared away Billy, Mandy exits the house. Mandy then looks back and discovers that Miss Doolin was actually a ghost. In the final scene, we discover from a portrait that Grim knew her for quite a long time, and had finally come to reap her soul. What's more unsettling is the fact that Miss Doolin had known Grim for so long, almost as if Grim was her friend throughout her entire life, just like Mandy. The similarities are quite shocking. Now, just look at Miss Doolin and what she says constantly, beat death, and how Mandy constantly wins over Grimm in every episode, such as in arguments or situations. Also, if you look at the pendant that Miss Doolin is wearing, you can see that it is in fact a spider. Mandy always has an affinity towards spiders, and has shown no fears towards Jeff the Spider. Furthermore, look at how Miss Doolin reacted when Mandy said that Billy didn't allow Mandy to play. Who killed who? Simply because Mandy was a girl. Miss Doolin reacted violently, but never really stated why. What if she's remembering the exact words when Billy told her all those years ago? It should also be noted that at the very beginning of the show, Mandy could have beaten Grimm in a staring contest, but in reality, she beat him in a limbo competition. Due to Miss Doolin's old age, she could have confused the staring contest that she had with Billy and the limbo contest that she had with Grimm. Mandy could be a very senile old woman who is remembering her old childhood memories in the form of Miss Doolin, and she has begun to imagine what she's experienced as a child. However, instead of normal people, she remembers monsters, as she is schizophrenic. Have you ever noticed how the show progressively gets weirder and weirder? This could be due to the fact that she is slowly losing her mind, but yet in her imagination. Everything that is going on is perfectly ordinary. For example, Season 6, Episode 10, the plan to force obedience upon Mandy backfires. And Mandy seemingly takes control of the people around her by simply commanding them to do so. This points to Mandy being the controller of the world, just like a child playing pretend. It also shows what Mandy will inevitably become, an old woman whose soul shall be reaped by Grimm. In her last dying breath, she realizes that Grimm had finally won.